Welcome back to Kennard Bosmer. I hope you enjoyed that showdown uh, segment. But for now, we're joined by Franz Manila once again. Franz, you know, you went to LA for the NBA All-Star Weekend this mm -hmm. year. And from, if you guys have been following Franz on Twitter or Instagram or Facebook, when I was watching your stories and Snapchats, like you were all around LA. How, how, was, the, how was the experience like compared to, well, just overall, how was the experience? Uh, well, pretty much uh, in Toronto, it was enjoyable, mm -hmm. right? And it was the first time here in LA. Um, like the venues are like all over the place. There's one downtown, there's one across the street. There's uh, also like um, pretty much like I mean 15 uh, minutes away from uh, the venue. So yeah, like you said, it's all over the place. Uh, they have it in LA Convention and uh, they have it in Staples. Mm -hmm. uh, pretty much, uh, yeah, it was, it was a lot of fun. You know, it was a lot of you know, good experience. Um, I mean, not being from LA, uh, it was pretty new to me, and um, it's actually pretty good. Uh, I've met some uh, friends there, mm -hmm. you know, and um, I was through them. I was able to uh, find out some uh, events that I didn't know existed. So if it wasn't for those guys that I met there, I wouldn't have known that you know there's like a 2K event where mm -hmm. you know um, Demar Derozan and Damon Lillard were playing NBA 2K, yeah. you know, along with uh, you know Rachel Demita. So uh, for me, you know, that was a big deal, and uh, also. Um, they also told me that there was like a meet and greet with like, um, you know, uh, what's his name, uh, Carl Anthony Towns and um, uh, Rick Fox and other, you know, Laker players. Mm -hmm. So um, other than that, um, when they went to the, you know, media day, um, that was really, really yeah. like the best, you know, time for me. Um, some legends were throwing out some T-shirts. Uh, let's say, uh, you know, Ron Harper was there. Muggsy Bogues was there. So pretty much uh, what happened was... Uh, they threw out a T-shirt. I was able to catch it, and you know, inside the T-shirt there was uh, a ticket. So inside, you know, uh, the ticket was was saying that uh, I won like um, an access inside with the media. So what it says there, it says Team LeBron. So once Team LeBron came on the uh, the, the the pod, um, I was able to go in, you know, along with the other winners. I was able to take, you know, videos and uh, pictures. So, you know, I was extremely lucky to, like, you know, uh, get that um, the ticket, you know, come from from Toronto, go in there. I was like, wow, like, this is amazing. It's like, Gain you know, that golden ticket, yeah, Willy like, Wonka style. <laughs> God gave me this day. Like, you know, I was like, it was so amazing. Yeah. yeah. What was, uh, what, when you decide that, you know, this was the all-star game to go for in terms of like, traveling all the way to the U.S.? Like, because there's... Other oh, all-star events that you could have gone like to. What made you decide that L this was the one yeah. to go to? Okay, so first things first, I have family in LA, so okay. which I was lucky to have. Okay. You yeah. know, and uh, funny story, what happened was, it's actually my dad's idea. I had no intentions of going <laughs> to the all-star game, so my dad was like, "Hey, the all-star game's in LA. You know, uh, let's go check it out." So I'm like, "Okay, dad, uh, I'll I'll pay for your ticket. I'll pay for the flight," and then, um, but my mom didn't allow him. Oh. <laughs> so. Um, I was like, okay, you know what? I've made up my mind, I'll go. And uh, I have, you know, cousins there and stuff. So I decided to go. Yeah. And then, you know, I just, uh, you know, uh, made it happen. Oh, wow. Yeah. Awesome. What was your favorite memory being in LA during that whole weekend? Uh, during that whole weekend, uh, so pretty much that Saturday. Uh, yeah, meeting. Um, Wait, which you know. games did you watch? What were the events oh. that you watched, actually, the whole So my, my very first thing was, uh, I went to the celebrity game and then the uh, rookie sophomore game. Okay. Um, well, it was too bad the rookie sophomore game. I was, you know, um, expecting more, but it, it was a it was a blowout. Yeah. It wasn't right? that bad though. Yeah. Oh well, yeah, they had a dunk off in the end. <laughs> yeah. And then, um, yeah, I met Damian Lillard before before going to the celebrity game, which was fun. And then after that, uh, the very next day was the media day, which was the best day. I went there. Yeah, I won, like I said, I won the ticket. And then after that, uh, I went to go meet uh, Jimmy Butler and then Carl Anthony Towns. And then um, uh, the very next day, I also met um, Ingram from the Lakers. And uh, uh, oh, yeah, and uh, actually uh, on the Sunday, I had a funny experience. So, um, in this venue, you should be able to have like some sort of a subscription uh, with um, Verizon. Well, okay. obviously we have Rogers. Yeah. I'm from Canada, right? And um, my friend just was able to just give me like you know a pass. So we were going there. We were gonna line up for Dr. J. So as soon as we get there, they stopped the line. Mm -hmm. 
Oh. We weren't able to go in and take a picture with him. Oh. So what I did, I went inside the restaurant, kind of waited for him. You know, uh, I see him walking by. I'm like, hey, Dr. J. You know, I was so excited. You know, he he smiled and then you know he waved at me, and then uh, I waited. And then uh, the, you know his security guards were like, you know, you know eyeing me hard, like you know I was gonna attack Dr. J. <laughs> like, he's a legend. No, like, like, yeah. You know, it's a <laughs> one-time opportunity, right? So I waited, I waited. So he's finally about to come out, and um, I wanted to take, you know, uh, some sort of picture with him, a selfie. Um, so I tried my best, and then, uh, as you see, I, don't, I mean, I have the, the vid, but um, what the security was, they were pushing me away. Dr. J was, like, shaking my hand, and then, you know, he smiled. And then uh, while I was like, hey, Dr. J, how are you? The security pushed me, was pushing me back, so yeah. I didn't really get the chance to uh, to do anything. But other than that, my consolation was uh, right after uh, Donovan Mitchell was around, so he was doing you know um, meet and greet with the fans. So I was able to take a, mm -hmm. a, a picture with him, which which was awesome. Mm -hmm. yeah. Give us a, give us a full lineup of all the people like celebrity players. Like, well, who did you meet like from Friday till the end of your trip? Because you had someone too after your trip from the uh, the All Star game, which you told us. So oh, okay. Let's go from like the beginning <laughs> well, to I the didn't, end. I didn't hear about Give us a one. list of the people that you met and had pictures with as you go through your whole trip. Okay, so the first one was Damian Lillard. Yeah. Right, and then uh, did he sign your ball? Was that the ball he signed, or was that? Yeah, like... yeah, that was the ball. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Well, that was my cousin's ball actually. Oh. It wasn't even mine. Yeah. Yeah. So um, so Damian Lillard first, and then. Um, after that, uh, yeah, that was that was it for the Friday. And then yeah. Saturday, um, yeah, I was able to go to uh, uh, inside and uh, I got to meet Guillermo. Oh too, yeah. Uh, too bad I didn't get to take a picture <laughs> with him. Um, you see Carlos Boozer and uh, Stephen Jackson walking mm -hmm. around. Yeah. Um, uh, well, so oh, yeah, I see Anthony Davis. You know, come around. Uh, I have a video video of that on my Instagram. And then uh, who else? Uh, so later on in the day, I met yeah Carl Anthony Towns and then uh, Jimmy Butler, and then um, what else? Oh yeah, so I met Demar Derozan. I really didn't get to take a picture. I just shook his hand. Uh, they were heading back from uh, you know um, them playing NBA 2K. Who else? Uh, uh, Ronnie 2K. If you guys know, he you know he's the guy that I think. I'm not sure created uh, NBA 2K. He is like, he's a, like, he's like a producer, Spokes, or spokesperson, yeah, for yeah, NBA spokesperson. 2K. Yeah, yeah. So him, I met him, uh, and uh, you know, uh, everyone's crush, Rachel Demita. <laughs> you know, I he's mean, living the dream. It's yeah. it's, it's funny because like, <laughs> so after Damon Lillard and uh, Demar Derozan finished, you know, playing, mm -hmm. everyone got up and everyone started, you know, uh, going to the players. Yeah. I went straight to Rachel Demita. <laughs> I'm like. That's you know, classic yeah. France right there. <laughs> I was so, like, I'm not gonna like leave until I get a picture with her. Like yeah. that was my goal, like yeah. take a picture. I, I was able to, uh, luckily. And then uh, after that, um, yeah, the next day, uh, yeah. So pretty much the next day is uh, Ingram, Brandon Ingram, and then um, oh, I was able to take a picture with uh, you know my idol, White Mamba, <laughs> you know Brian Scalabrini, Ooh, Scalabrini. Hey. you know. Um, the legend, the legend. The legend. <laughs> <laughs> um, who else? Uh, yeah, and then uh, Donovan Mitchell. Um, I tried to get into uh, the line with uh, Rick Fox, but it was too late. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, like so. you probably, you could probably see if you play 2K or you watch the NBA 2K series on YouTube or mm -hmm. anything, you might catch Grant Miller in one of those episodes when uh, Demar Rose and Demi Damian Lillard are playing against each other in the. 2K battle. I don't know. I, I might. I might have been just been playing 2K and I saw France. But he, he might be there. Might be there. Um, do you think? Do you think you're gonna go? Uh, do you think it's like a nice experience to go again? Whether like What's depending, your depending on the city, depending yeah. on the city though. Like next year, the Charlotte. Mm -hmm. Or are they going back to New Orleans? Maybe what's one? Like if you had to describe that one tr in two words or three words, how would you describe your whole trip? Uh, amazing, awesome, and. Mm -hmm. uh, the best. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, well, well, my my uh, advice is um, so everything that happens during the also weekend, it's always gonna be downtown. So that's my biggest mistake because mm. I know it always starts on Thursday. Yeah. So I got there Wednesday night. I knew it was gonna start Thursday, not Friday. So Thursday there was an event with Kobe Bryant and uh, James Harden. I miss both. I miss both events because oh, wow. uh, I was so excited, you know, just being in LA, yeah. you know, talking to my uh, <laughs> relatives. So I miss both. So. So those two things, if anyone um, wants to go to an all-star event um, during the weekend, start on a Thursday and make yeah. sure you go to the, you know, downtown. That's where it all starts. 
And uh, finally, um, like Mark was asking me, uh, the other guy that I met along the road, well, he's not a really an NBA player. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> if, you guy, if you guy know uh, this guy, uh, it says, uh, uh, what do you call that? These nuts or something? <laughs> oh, <laughs> he met these nuts. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's, so, a, there's a comedian on Instagram. Yeah, Instagram he was all, Instagram comedian, if you guys don't know. <laughs> he was one of the yeah, two biggest. Yeah. Internet sensation. <laughs> exactly, he exactly, exactly. He's exactly. the best person he ever met. That's how I like uh, it. <laughs> he was walking around <laughs> Vegas, making, you know, making some weird sounds. And then he was like, what's up? So I don't know, I just said, what's up, back. I didn't realize it was him. So I, I kept walking. And then, you know, he, he took over, he walked um, across me, and then I'm like, oh, hey, it's him, you know? So uh, I'm like, hey, you know what, uh, let's take a picture together. Yeah. He's like, yeah, and that was it. Hey, man, you catch all of France Manila's memories, so, uh, heading out all the way to L.A. for the All-Star Weekend. What, what, what's your Instagram account where they can check it out? Uh, it's uh, fmanila at, uh, on Instagram.